Welcome back everybody. Today we're going to do an update video to the CZ Evo Scorpion review that we did. As you can see here we have the tax stamp in. Other very important additional information has come out. Uh, over at NRA Show 2015, CZ announced basically that they are going to be providing a, a packet of goods, if you will, packet of parts that are going to make this gun 922R compliant when you actually SBR it. Now, CZ is going to be releasing those to the general public, I believe, here in a few months. There's also several different companies that are making those compliance parts for it. So there's a ton of different ways to do it. We have it set up here with a few of them that we're trying out. And uh, basically what we're going to do is just keep running a bunch of rounds through it. And then we're going to report back in a later video basically of how these different parts function, how to install them, all that stuff. Additionally, one thing that we don't have here yet, but we will have, is going to be CZ is going to be making the factory folded stock. But they're going to be making it here in the United States. So what that's going to do is give you another compliance part if you want to use that. Uh, obviously here we just have a different U.S. made stock and extension here. Uh, this is the B5 system, Satma Bravo. But that is how it's going to be done. So uh, this one here we put in for the tax stamp. About seven weeks later we got it in. And then we had to wait until we got all the uh, 922R compliance parts to bring it up to uh, 922R code, if you will. And uh, we also got in the 30 rounders, which we didn't have in the last video. So 30 round mags, these are available over at CZ's website. Uh, function's been perfect. The gun still has been absolutely 100% reliable. So we certainly can't complain about it there. Uh, additionally, threw a uh, RMR on there at the Enforce WML, a little Bravo company uh, sort of angled vertical foregrip. And this thing really is a excellent little personal defense weapon. So right now, we are currently testing those those parts like we talked about. We'll get into all those uh, details coming up uh, a little bit later on, but I just wanted to give an update because I know a lot of people are still interested in this gun, um, had questions about that, what the ruling was going to be, whether or not it had to be 922R compliant. Uh, CZ reports that the uh, ATF here says that it is and does have to be compliant, so we uh, are going to go along with that. We put the parts on, test them out. Like I said, CZ is going to be coming out with that kit or parts kit or bundle, whatever they're going to call it. Uh, here not too long. So that's about it. We also have a ton of other companies parts which are in here which we're working with and we will get to a review of again later on down the road. So that's the update guys. Really is pretty cool to have it in this SBR form. It's so much more shootable like this uh, infinitely. I wish we didn't have laws that prohibited us from just buying it like this but it is what it is. You got the tax stamp back and we are uh, putting rounds down range. If you guys have any questions or anything like that, you can post below in the comments section. You can also post over at my Facebook page as always. But thanks for watching, guys. Thanks for subscribing, and we hope to see you in the next video.